Yeah, Sharon and Jess, the University of Maine system announced yesterday that it will be moving all of its classes to an online format after spring break, which for these students is next week. That means that by Sunday, March 22nd, all students are expected to be moved off campus and they'll start their virtual courses on Monday, March 23rd. There are about 29,000 students in the UMaine system and 8,000 who live in dorms across the state. Well, decisions to close schools nationwide Wide are made to protect students. They're also designed to protect faculty and staff who actually may be more vulnerable to COVID-19. Researchers have said that the virus appears to be more harmful to the older population and to people with chronic health conditions. The president of USM told us yesterday that those were all factors that went into the university system's unprecedented decision. So one of the reasons we're doing this is to try to flatten that curve, particularly for university students, so that they're not getting the virus back here in Maine, passing it on between themselves and also uh, hurting the community at large. And USM's president also says that the UMaine system is considering some type of refunding program, but those details are unclear right now. And Bowdoin College also announced yesterday that it will be moving all of its classes to an online format after its spring break. Now, we want to remind people that there are steps you can take every day just to try to prevent the spread of this disease. You should try to wash your hands for 40 seconds at a time, use hand sanitizer, avoid large crowds, and to try to wipe down clean shared surfaces um, like phones or laptop keyboards. In Orono, Chloe Thibault, New Center, Maine.